thumb wheel that is by the audio controls on the steering wheel. So this guy right here, you'll notice it can scroll up and down. It can also press in like a button. Now what this thumb wheel does is used for entertainment. Up on the instrument cluster, depending on the entertainment you have selected currently, right now I'm in the FM band, if you use the thumb wheel, you can scroll through the different entertainment. As you can see, it's bringing up the FM band, all the stations that are uh, populated on the FM listing that I'm getting a good strong signal of are populating up in the instrument cluster. Uh, note that if you do have heads up display, this will actually display up on the windshield, but uh, for those that don't, it will display on the instrument cluster. Once you find a station you like, press in that thumb wheel like a button and you'll notice the check mark, check mark indicates that station has changed and that is currently the station that is playing. If I had, um, you know, CDN, I could, you know, do sim something similar where I can change the track. Uh, if I was doing Bluetooth connection, same thing, music collection, whatever it may be. Depending on the uh, entertainment, you'll see that the instrument cluster will illustrate up on there that I can change the song, have access to the entertainment. The thumb wheel can also be used for recent call history on phones that are Bluetooth to the car uh, that are connected. If I press the phone button here, press that, and then use my thumb wheel, I'd be able to access the recent history on the device that's paired to the phone. And you'll notice again that that would display up on the instrument cluster as well. Um, fortunately, right now I don't have anything paired, but it would show the recent call history right up there. So you can directly access people that you've been talking to um, instead of having to scroll through an entire phone book or whatnot just kind of a quick access to any number that you need that you recently talked to. So hopefully that helps clear up a couple questions about the thumbwheel. If you have anything for me, let me know, leave a comment or, uh, you know, feel free to email me.